Welcome back to Broken Bobby's Weight Loss Transformation page. If you're new to the page, welcome. If you're returning to the page, I appreciate your continued support. If this is something that interests you or you think you know somebody that may be interested in this, please share it to them. Also like, hit that subscribe button, and leave a comment. Let me know what you think, what I can do better. If you have any questions, bring them. Um... Anyways, today we're going to be hitting the gym. I tore some ligaments in my right shoulder. Uh, that's what the MRI said. So I'm going to be hitting the orthopedic surgeon on the 14th to figure out what the next plan is. Anyways, so we're going to be going into the gym, getting a full workout. It's going to be a lighter weight, but what are you going to do, you know? Like, you got to do something, right? So, anyways, let's go to the gym. And here we are with the rope pull-downs. I try to do three sets of 12. Like I said, it just depends on the night and how I'm feeling. Some nights, you know, it's, it's a struggle to get to three sets of 10. And other nights... I might be doing four or five sets of 12 to 15. You know, it just depends on how well the rest was and everything the night before. All right, now we're doing a seated pec fly machine. And on these ones, you wanna, it's like you you wanna arch your back a little bit and push your chest up. And it, the idea is you bring your elbows as close together as you can. You really feel that in the chest. Uh, it's really good exercise and I superset this with the rope pull downs for the tricep. All right, now it looks like we're on flat bench here. So this is just a bench press. Uh, I'm doing light weight. It's a lot less than I normally would do, but due to this shoulder injury or the ligament tears, I should say, you know, I can't go too hard. I don't want to risk further injury. So, and I'm down to uh, one push and one pull session a week. This is the push session. And like I said, you know, like here we are again with the uh, rear delts trap area. And I do three sets of 12, but you know what? It's whatever feels good. Some nights it might be two sets. Some nights it might be five sets. Some nights it might be 15 pounds. Some nights it might be 25. It just depends on how I feel. Okay, so now we're on some incline bench and this is gonna work the upper part of the chest. Like I said, I'm on light weight here. I'm just kind of breaking back into this. I was doing two sets of pull and two sets of push a week, but now I'm down to one set. And it, like I said, it's lighter weight just to maintain basically. So I don't lose the gains that I've already gotten. So, uh, and I like to, when I do these bench press motions, I like to do them in a super set. This is a really good tricep exercise for growth. Uh, this is a three-step tricep pull down single arm with just a regular handle and it's like 15 20 pounds and you do 8 to 10 at the first spot, 8 to 10 at the second spot and then at the third spot then you switch hands and do it over again. These are really good for uh, completely activating the triceps getting the, the large head, the medial head and the small head uh, this is a staple of my workout and actually I think my triceps are one of my better developed features but like I said it's about routine like you want to be consistent in what you're working to see the growth uh, you just gotta keep going you know it, the grass is gonna grow where you water it so I water the triceps a lot <laughs> so see me getting it here i do about 45 seconds of rest in between and then just keep it pushing all right guys so here we go overhead presses this is one of the areas that is real sensitive as you see i'm doing light weight here just because of the injury but you know it's just about being in routine that's what most of this is if you follow a routine you will grow and you will lose weight also if that's what you're looking to do so it's routine. Okay, so I like to do things in supersets, more than one exercise combined just for time restraints. This is for the rear delts or the traps, depending on how you do them. And I do these in sets of 12 as well. So there you have it. That is my push routine. Um, so what it is, like I said, it's getting in the habit of a routine. You wanna 
continue to work the same muscles on a schedule. Whether it be twice a week, once a week, whatever. You just got to start doing something. So, listen to me. Stop drinking your calories. It's a lot easier to go into a caloric deficit if you're not drinking sodas and taking in all this sugar. Stop Slow down on the potato chips and stuff. Watch what you eat. Get that MyPlate app. Use it. Get in a routine of working out. It seems like it creates anxiety now, but once you get in the habit of doing this, you'll have anxiety when you can't do it. Whether it be in a gym or doing hit routines, like the last video, you can do those at a truck stop even, you know what I mean? So, get in the habit of working out, and don't look at the mountain, just start climbing.